Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Zendesk to Slack in 2024. We're enhancing the collaboration and communication with Zendesk and Slack. So this integration ensures that you support your team, stays in the loop, and you can quickly address customers' inquiries. So stick around as I guide you through the step-by-step -step guide on how to do it. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll have to go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, it could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, just simply go to the CRL section, type zen disk dot com and hit the enter button once you do so you'll be taken to the home screen or main screen of zendesk right away so if you have an account go to here and click on sign in to sign in into your account if you don't have an account you'll have to click on free trial and start creating your account if you're interested about the pricing as an example for service here's it you can pause the video and read everything out by your own with the features this annually and this monthly and for sales, this is going to be the pricing for it annually and monthly. Of course, that depends on the number of agents. If you change the number of agents, as an example, it might change for you. The price might change for you, as an example. So this is the price for per agents. So for me here, I'll just go and sign in into my account. So here I'll have to enter my URL. If you forgot it, just enter here and click on remind me and then go to your email provider because I forgot mine also and of course you'll have to wait a bit until they send you like or you can go all emails in case if they send it to me or spam you can check okay it's not even this one my bad I'll have to go to this one and yeah so this one okay this is the one that I want I'll simply have to click on any of those that I want and click on it. This one. Okay, let's just go and use this one. Okay, so maybe this one without this. Without this and dot com. Sign in. You already registered. Okay, so let's just go to the second one and check. Okay, so it's incorrect. Just do this and remove this, like this and this, and sign in. And yeah, this will sign me in, I guess. Yeah. So once you're connected to your account, you will find yourself right here. What we'll need to do, of course, is simply once you open your Zendesk and log into your account, you can, of course, finish this get started. Finishing this get started will basically just make you learn everything about Zendesk. That's if you know if you don't know how to navigate through it and etc. They have some explicit time on what to do as an example on every step. So it will take, I guess, in total 40 minutes. 10, like 8, 18 plus 12, like 30, 13, 10, 40, 43 minutes. As you can see but what we care about to of course connect this zendesk to slack is apps and integration they show you here a video one minute video how to uh, like uh, do the apps and integrations and you can even explore the marketplace if you want to like uh, go and connect as you can see we can find even slack in here so we can just simply go and click on explore all apps we go here of course if you want to like access this maybe if you don't have this get started option if you are on your dashboard how can you access that simply you can go as an example instead of searching and here you can go and type here an example zen sorry zendesk.com slash marketplace as simple as that so market place no need to add anything just go and hit that and let's see as you can see so they will take you here, go and click on apps, and you will be taken to the marketplace without any problem. If they ask you to sign in, just click on sign in again, and you will be signing into your account right away. As an example. So very simple. Uh, for security, maybe they have a problem, so it's fine. And now, as an example, once we are on this marketplace, we'll have to go and look for Slack. So go and look for Slack. 
plates. I don't know why I didn't find it. Normally it should be there. So let's just go back and click on apps in here. And we will definitely, we should definitely find Slack. Yeah, yeah. Now it's there. As you can see, it's free. So if you want to connect it, it's very free. You don't have to pay or something like that. And here as an example, you can simply click on get set up and how to set up visits our install page to get started and etc. Basically, you'll have to click on sign up to sign up. Oh, I don't know why it did log me off my account. Let me just try with another account. Why not? Or create a new one. An example, click on next. Click on it here. Yeah, I'm just changing names, but it's fine. Change those last numbers. It says it is. Yes, next, next. And the password, I'll just go with the same as this one. As simple as that. Click on save. Open this to verify it. Of course, I'll have to wait a bit until they send me an email. Should not take a lot of time, maybe just one minute or so. I don't know why they have a problem with my accounts. Yeah, so for security numbers, things, I don't know why, but it's fine. I have to go here, no mails, and we'll have to wait for the email until we receive it. Yeah, here is it. Verify your account. I don't need this anymore. And I don't even need this. No thanks, I don't need to go through this. So yeah, I guess just a problem of verifying your account. But as we said before, just look for Slack. As we saw before, I don't know if I can get us back. And you click on sign up. Instead of this page, it will show you or it will give you get you to sign up into your Slack account and the integration will be already done. You can of course choose some channel and notifications and configure Slack integrations and then test everything, then save the settings inside the Slack option. And then you will be good to go. So I guess there you have it. You successfully connected Zendesk to Slack in 2024. Now your uh, support team can collaborate seamlessly, receive timely notification, and enhance customer service. So if you have any question or there is a specific topic that you would like me to cover in the next video, just drop it down below in the comment section. I'll try to do it as soon as possible. And if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe to our channel for more hair for tutorials like this one. So happy supporting. And I'll see you in the next video. So goodbye.